two. This is going to be my video. I'm playing with a microwave transformer, as you can see right here. I ain't got it set up into anything special. See that right there? Yes, that's a big. That's from a little microwave, a little microwave. And I took this and rigged up a little connection, put a little ball thing right there. This come off of the mag magnetron. See. Rattle inside, it ain't really shit. The only way you can get a nice arc like this is have two capacitors in, in parallel. This right here is coming out of your secondary into the first capacitor, out of the first capacitor, into the second, out of the second, in, and then out. As you see right there. Excuse my table, it is a mess. I ain't been cleaned up. I gotta clean up stuff around here. And I got a very small or limited space to work with. And here's my chicken stick. Gotta have a chicken stick. And it's got the little thing on the end of it. It's rounded a little bit. It's not the best, but it's working right. I had a bigger transformer. As you can see down there. It was arc, it was jumping sparks somehow and it was kept blowing the fuse, blowing the breaker. Yep, just touch this right here. <laughs> you didn't see those spark, did you? Alright, here I go. You ready to plug it in? See, I got it. My chicken stick, let me show you right here, is grounded right here with the ground wire coming out of the power supply right there if you ground it to this to the transformer make sure you clean off the area because it's covered in enamel they dip the whole transformer in enamel all right get ready to plug this bad boy in with the cord that is salvaged from the microwave okay see what i can do with just like i'm doing Alright, here we go. Be careful. The, this will hurt you. It will kill you, actually. If you don't use two capacitors, you'll get a little silt, a little dumbass spark that won't go no further than that. But you have to have two of them. Two per transformer. Well, there you have it. High voltage arcing. And after you unplug it, of course, tap this right here and make sure you're discharged, your capacitor's discharged. And yeah, there you have it. Let me show you how it's hooked up. Okay, here is my salvage power supply or the cord from the microwave. And I have this clip there. This is getting pretty, pretty warm. Might just take it off and automatically just hook it to that to the transformer by itself, but yeah. And then here's the ground wire hooked right here, as you see. And then my chicken stick wire is hooked right there with the ground wire. It doesn't matter which way you put it because you're just working with DC, there's no AC. Okay, so polarity is only for AC, not DC. And like I said, oh, that motherfucker's hot. <laughs> all right, excuse me for all that. This is your your two hookups is your primary. With your single hookup that goes to your capacitor is your secondary. That's where the high voltages come out at. Okay, let me get my rag because that thing is pretty warm. Yeah, so caution. Besides high electricity voltage, 
or high voltages that can and will kill you. When you're done playing, be careful because it is really hot. Kind of warming, cooling down, but it's kind of it's really hot. Capacitors are cool. But yeah, I have these separated. I want to put them together, but I don't know what that would do. So I'm just gonna do it either just like that. Like I said, off of your power supply, your plug, hook it to your primary. Your ground out of your power supply, you hook it to right here. Or anywhere on there that you can put a screw. And then, of course, your chicken stick. And there you have it, people. High voltage arcing. Peace out.